Can you hear me, sir? Sir, stay with me. No longer charred. Also, my clothes have come back. I made that scar way too big on his chin, but I don't mind. <laughs> stay with me, sir. His heart got taken. What do you mean, stay Thank with goodness. you? How are you feeling? This is the second time I've watched over you like this, isn't it? You do not remember? Then have you forgotten that you protected me from the dragon's flames? You withstood the fire in my stead and were well and truly charred. It was terrible. I had thought your life forfeit. I could not hear the beating of your heart. But you hung on and by some miracle survived. I seem to have become arisen. Arisen? I'm afraid I don't understand your meaning. <laughs> I'm the Arisen now. Does it have aught to do with why you were taken to the castle? They said twas so that your wounds could be treated. Though I fear you have no memory of this either. I am of the Border Watch. Someone with Arisen-like abilities came to this village all in tow. Know you all of this? Has he come for you? We are to part so soon then. Mayhap you will visit me again someday. Mayhap, Bar Wench. Well <laughs> Take care. Fare thee well, Bar Wench. Your finest ale, please. Everson. All right, I'm going to get a drink after this now. Ah, excellent. You must be the one. You match my soldier's description. I'm glad I found you. The ruler of Vermin, currently convalescing in the capital, became arisen here in this very village. If you claim the same, then word must be borne to the capital. I dispatched a missive before coming here, though I doubt the matter can be settled without your presence. Would you be willing to accompany me to the capital? If you truly are arisen, you will be received with open arms. Oh, but forgive me, I scattered my soldiers in a bid to find you. I would not depart without them. We shall have to wait till they are reassembled. Come to think of it, Sir Leonard was asking after you as well. Mayhap now would be a good time to speak with him. Last I saw, he was having a drink at the inn. This is a very... Uh... What say we gather some information? Whoa, what the... They're with me now? Wait, what the hell's happening? <laughs> I'm so confused. How are you with me? I thought I, just, I, thought I was in a flashback. What the fuck? I'm very confused. I thought we were in a flashback. <laughs> yeah, I'm very confused right now. <laughs> I don't understand what's going on. Here's a ladder. Shall we see where it leads? But we were just Up in a burnout village. Arisen. And then a girl looked at us. And then all of a sudden, we were here? I'm assuming we're still in the flashback. But, but for whatever reason, the pawns are here. <laughs> How would the flashback be just be the dragon? We were literally in a burnt-out town, weren't we? Wait, hang on. Where are we now? Melv. Yeah, we, we, were, we were literally just in burnt-out Melv, right? Oh, wait, is that burnt-out Melv? Oh, okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> Right, okay. I've, this is why I was confused. I was like, well, the town's fine, so it must be in a flashback. That's the burnt out bit. <laughs> that bit's burnt, this bit's not. That was very confusing to me, that, that whole bit. I thought we were still in the flashback. Like, we got burnt and then woken up. Right, okay. So after we got, after we got burnt up by the dragon, we got taken away. By, 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 to the, to the by people. Right, okay. Now I understand. That was very I Like, that was... The way that happened was very confusing to me. I have 
Zeus. I shall not fail you. <laughs> Someone's about to get a giant arrow in them. <laughs> don't trust me with that stuff, I don't think. Can you bang in this? I, I don't know. I haven't looked into that bit. <laughs> Hasn't really been a priority of me. There are 240 of these tokens. 240? Jesus. Scattered across the land, hidden in all sorts of out-of-the-way and unexpected places. Bring them to a guild hall, and you will receive special awards now and then as your collection progresses. You must leave no stone unturned nor corner of the world unexplored if you would complete your... 240? Holy oh, shit, that's a lot. here's a surprise. At least all our efforts weren't for naught. Interesting. I shall have to inform my own master of this. Ah. Uh, that's cool. Master, there is a... There's a thing here. Oh, that's kind of cool. Like that. We might have to... We might have to replace Xanthropy and Mac. They're going to get behind us in levels at the moment. Alright. There's something written here. Oh. It couldn't hurt to take a peek. What's written? Written where? Written what? What's where? Where? Oh. What? Have you some ah, business with the apothecary, sir? Dreadful sorry if I was in your way. Oh, no. I'm not lost or naught, sir. You needn't worry yourself on my account. Naught or aught. <laughs> I'm an apothecary in training, you see. My family runs a little shop in Vanworth. So when I heard tell of a medicine only to be found Nort, in this village, ought, I thought I'd come and fetch some. Uh, and um, made the journey all by myself. Right, well, what was the other one? If you can believe it. <laughs> what was the other one? Was it Gadzook? Not Gadzook. Was the um? Well, well, as luck would have it, I've not enough gold for the medicine. Consarn, yeah, consarn it, <laughs> consarn it. <laughs> it will be a shame to return empty-handed after coming all this way. But what more can I do? She's got long fingers. Is this a scam? What? You'd do that? You'd get the medicine for me? Yep. Suppose there's no harm in that. If you're really sure. Oh, sir. I'd be most grateful. Why she got a joker smile? What the fuck? Seems my luck's not as rotten as I thought. I'll wait right here for your return, sir. And many thanks for your kindness. She's got that William Defoe Green Goblin smile going on. We could make the fruit robberant ourselves, or simply purchase some at Rune's Apothecary here in Melv. I'm somewhat of an apothecary myself. <laughs> I'm somewhat of a arisen myself. Ah, well met. Here for some fruit robberant, are we? Yep. What have you got? 600. It's daylight robbery. I'll make it myself. <laughs> 600? I, I'm, not, I'm not paying that much. Sorry, child. I don't have your fruit rubber on. I saw, I saw a new pair of daggers and I, I wanted them more. Wow, that is a... <laughs> That is, uh, that is really wide. The fuck? Why is this so big? It's far too big. It looks ridiculous. Plus, it hides my shoulders. I love how much taller Banjo is than me. <laughs> You're so tall. I'm gonna give you that one, buddy. I like, I think you look, I think that looks good on you. Do come again. I ain't buying that fucking fruit rober on though. That's expensive. I do as hell. so enjoy stocking up on supplies. Spending gold to make gold? Is that not a contradiction? I quite agree. What does this thing say behind you? Don't stumble around the dark. Off outfit yourself with one of our fine lanterns. But but mind how far you stay from home at night, lest beats be drawn to the glow of your hip like moss to a flame. You really ought to have returned by now. Who? Mayhap this time I went looking for it. Is that you, Norbert? No, very clearly not. Mayhap. Oh, fie. I got my hopes up for naught. Naught. 
Wait, listen. Would you be willing to search for my brother? The brave fool said he was going to look for herbs and went off into the forest. I've seen no sign of him since. Mayhaps. I know. Five. There's a bunch of words. I'd go and search for him myself, only... Only... It is a dangerous place. Understand? I, I, I'm not afraid of monsters. But it would hardly help anything if I were to run in there unprepared Twid. and get myself hurt now, would it? So I thought, mayhap, mayhap. you'd go in my place. You look like you could manage those woods better than I. Please, sir. I worry for my brother. Many thanks. Right. As for where I think he's gone, go into the forest and turn when you reach the tree with the bird's nest, keeping the cliff to your right. Okay. Go into the forest and turn when you reach the tree with the bird's nest, keeping the cliff to your right. Ah, oh, this won't work, will it? I could see the root in my mind's eye. But my feet know it better than I do. I don't think I could plot it on a map, and it's hard to describe. Just take me there. But my brother and I are the only ones who use that path, to my knowledge. I suppose there's only one thing for it. I'll have to show you the way. Okay. Just be alert. The monsters of the forest have changed since the dragon's attack. Right. I'll need you to watch over me. Keep me safe. You will, won't you? Yeah. Yeah. Right. In we go, then. My life's in your hands, friend. Our aid is required, Master. Let us depart with due haste. Oh, what luck! Tis a chest! Not all chests contain treasure, you know. Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm sorry, sorry, my guy. Sorry, buddy, my guy shouted about a chest. I have to go and see what he was going on there. There are useful ingredients to be gathered here, old wager. Old wager. I'd say we collect as much as we can carry. Sorry, I know I keep getting distracted. I apologize. I... <laughs> I, 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 we'll get, we'll, we will get back to saving your friend, I promise. Bloody hell, mate. Where are you taking us? This is a scam. Are you scamming this us? This is a good spot. Let's stop here a moment. I've camped here with my brother many a time. No doubt he caught his breath here before moving on. Same as us. Oh. A decent spot to make camp. Assuming there are no monsters about. It would be a fine spot to rest. Should we have need of one? Oh god, it's so heavy. There you go. <laughs> it's way too heavy for me, buddy. Jeez. Alright, let's make camp then. If the original is camping kidding had to hand, they can pitch their tent by the remnants of remains of a campfire. Found at set spots throughout the wilderness. Much like staying at an inn in town, resting at campfire restores the party's health and stamina and recovers the lost gauge. Adventurers who seldom return to town should be sure to keep a camping kit in their packs. Oh. Camping also affords the opportunity to grill meat, granting a boost to certain stats upon consumption. The finer the quality of the meat, the greater the increase you can expect. Before setting up camp, it would be prudent to eliminate any foes lurking nearby. Neglecting to do so only heightens the chance of an ambush while your party is at its most vulnerable. I enjoy tackling fierce foes and prefer combat's thrills to gathering items. Okay. You don't have to announce how you act as a human being. Now we've the vim to tackle the day ahead. Yes, we do. Off we go, then. I hope you slept well. Oh, shit. Let's get him, boys. Freshly rested as we are, this battle ought to be a thing. Try not to get hit. Let's do that vim goes away. <laughs> Flames. Oh, that was let's go. thrilling. I did not know I could. I see not even the arisen could resist my charms. No. Quite the trip this has been. Oh, shit. Can anyone hear me? Please. I need help. Wolves. Oh, shit. I'll turn you into a pink cushion! I knew you would prevail, Master. 
Wolves in the original, such a pain in the ass. Oh my god. I, I thought I was done for. Ah, oh, it was a near thing. How are you feeling? I think I'll be all right. But if you hadn't come for me, I. Thanks, Ian. Mm. Excuse me, I'm being attacked by wolves. Help me. Save your thanks, Norbert. I'm your brother, and I ought have come sooner. From where I'm standing, all that matters is that you made it in time. Anyway, I'm eager to be rid of this place. Let's return to the village, shall we? From my perspective, it's the Jedi that are the enemy. The sooner the better. I've got to deliver these medicinal herbs to the people who need them. Ah, you'll hear no complaints from me. Let's be off then. We ought to avoid combat if we can. Our priority is to see our charge delivered safely. Oh, we gotta go take him back to Mel now. Okay. That was well thought. There's no one standing who might say otherwise. Well, I'm sure there's still room for improvement. Uh, no, 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 no. To me, I'm supposed to be protecting them. Uh, I just saw a, a big health bar there. <laughs> oh, uh, apologies, master. My mind was a thousand leagues away. <laughs> That would be why there's a boss bar. Over here. Oh God, Jesus. Oh, good lord. <laughs> I just got fucking crushed. <laughs> Absolutely crushed by that foot then. Holy moly. I'll wager I could make that shot. Be sure to aim true. A statue. I cannot help but suspect it's guiding us somewhere. Climbing it would grant clearer pictures of life. Be wary. This is where we stop getting past. Really going after Mac. <laughs> You can uh, grab hold of a foe while standing by making contact with them by pressing R trigger. Once you have a hold of an enemy, you can push or pull them to draw their focus or knock them off balance. Yeah. Fuck you! Fuck you! Uh, uh, in the face! Uh, uh, uh. 
Get him in the face, let's go! Let's go! Hereabouts. I'd say we collect as much as we can carry. Oh wow, that was so fun. I love that. The when the music kicked in then that was incredible. I uh I love I like jumped on him while he was like dizzy and then he like fell backwards and like clonked his head on the fucking tree. The, <laughs> the private quarters of one arisen I served had many a visitor. And rarely the same one. What what prompted now you to there's just the say thought. That, Uh, forgotten rift stones can be found in various locations uh, throughout the world, and when you touch one, one or two events will occur. The rift stone will be restored. You will be able to use the rift stone to summon unique pawns of a different nature to those that can be summoned in town. A high-level pawn will be summoned. A single high-level pawn will be summoned, after which the rift stone will disappear. You will be able to hire this pawn without paying any rift crystals. Ooh. Ooh. Go with Casablanca. Hmm. Carana? Oh, Glory. Oh, let's do Glory, actually. She's a bit less expensive. Hmm. Tis a pleasure to meet you. Yeah, I don't I don't like to pick anything too high a level. It tends to ruin the Sir Norbert vibe. has been found, and none the worse for wear. Let us return him to Melv at once. Pray, allow me to show you the way. Well, if you insist. I'm only glad I don't have to lead the way for a change. All right, Benji. <laughs> okay, buddy. I'll collect that. You needn't trouble yourself. All right, Glory. You've been a bit of a, you've been a bit of a overachiever now. Me thinks we could move this boulder if we work together. Me I thinks. say we give it a push and see what happens. Come on, boys. Let's, let's do it. Let's push it. I would gladly be obeyed, Arisen. Allow me. <laughs> I mean, we did it. I, you know, I don't know what that achieved, but we did it. Yon structure draws the eye. Mayhap it bears investigating. Ah, now here's a surprise. At least all our efforts weren't for naught. Interesting. I shall have to inform my own master of this. 
Yeah, you know, what if we push this rock down a on a hill? That'd be sick. Okay, okay. <laughs> These two are just like, can you please take us home now? Yeah, can't get home. Ooh, what's this? Ina is home. Well, I want to learn magic, please. This again, child. You know full well your father has forbidden it. There are plenty of things more deserving of your interest. Why not turn your aspirations elsewhere? Why must you always take father's side? I'd have thought you'd understand how I feel better than anyone. Hello? What am I to do with that girl? Would that I could allow her to do as she pleases, but... Tisn't to be. Tisn't to be. Tisn't. Tisn't. Tisn't, chat. Tisn't. Cheers to tisn't. Don't mind me, I'm just robbing you of your rift crystals. Not that you need them, because you can't summon pawn. What is it? If you're looking for Gran, she's out. It is dreadful dull round here. How long do they mean to shut me away? All I want is to study magic, but Gran refuses to teach me. If only I had a grimoire or two, then I could study on my own. If you find any grimoires, would you bring them to me? I have a grimoire, actually. You needn't seek them out. Any you happen to find will do. Still, I'll write up a list of the tomes I'd most like, so you know which ones to keep an eye out for. Let's see. Um, there. All done. Mayhap I was a little over eager. Mayhap. You needn't bring them all. Just two or three would be swell. Though I would be thrilled to have the lot. <laughs> oh, and Gran is like to confiscate the grimoires should she espy them. Pray hand them to me when she's not at home. I want to know what the dialogue is like in Japanese. <laughs> We don't do so, it like this. We are they? to scour for the grimoires on Miss Trisha's list. Let there be light. A grimoire filled of arcane power, certain to fascinate any sorcerer. Reading it casts a spell Imperium. And casts a skill spell High Thundermine. Oh, I saw that somewhere. I think that was in a shop. I've seen Fulminus Shield. I think I've seen that. Death Nell. So let there be light, from the shield, death knell, howling blizzard, tearing ill. Oh, I think a think Thava has a copy in his house at the checkpoint rest town. I found this one in a shop not far from here, but Gran wouldn't let me buy it. Yeah, I've seen that one. This one was full of forbidden magic, and was apparently used in the war. I heard that a sorcerer in eastern Vermont wrote this one, but that's all I know. I'll see I've not a clue where this one might be. Maybe someone who's really well read would know of it. Hmm, okay. Do you want me to go down this slope, master? Oh shit, we're going down the slope? Just bear in mind that I shan't be able to climb back up again. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, this girl's crazy. All right. I'm in. I'm in. Let's do it. Oh shit. Slide down and join me, master. <laughs> this is Rather thrilling. This is rather thrilling, says Banjo. Rather thrilling. Yeah, this, we really are just a, just a bunch of maniacs. Just like, I dare you, Risen. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Do it, do it. Slight detour, everybody. Slight detour. This is generally used as a material. Whoa. A different We've got goblins! Uh, leave it. Yeah. Oh. Been drenched. oh god. I've been drenched. They threw Stay stuff at me, me and risen. drenched me. Wait right there. Where are they? Oh they're up oh they're throwing rocks at us. Whoa. Never would have occurred to me. Well, well. Color me surprised. God damn, my guy just took off there. I'll gather this. It might be of use. Probably. Hey, there's the house I wanted to see. 
No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. The early Griffin gets the world. Whoa! Whoa! You take damage only as your health, remaining health reduced, but the maximum health you can recover is reduced also. The lost gauge represents the temporary reduction. It's like to accumulate if you do not rest between battles. Your maximum health will remain reduced even after the battle's over and you'll be able to recover. As they say. Perhaps you'd like to take care of the remainder. Well said. Well done, Master. We took care of the big guy. Oh, we are all still here. Okay. Oh. Over here. An impressive diversion. Will I finish them off, Arisa? We are at our best when we combine our strength. Hide cape. Mm. If, I, if, if, I ever, if I ever somehow have the technology to make Banjo talk, I'm giving him this voice. <laughs> Hello there. Master. I require feeding, Master. Excellent. Our objective is in hand. <gasps> we got Fruit Rober on. <laughs> I did it. I managed to avoid fucking paying for it. <laughs> Might Let's you consider go. lightening your pack, Master? Yeah, I am pretty over overweight right now. Let's see. What can we do without? It looks so big. It looks so... Why is it so big? It's so big. Oh. Yeah, even on Panda, I think it looks a little too big. Oh, I just, it's yeah, just, just big. Just big, big, big thing. I don't know why they made it so ridiculously huge. Well, I'm glad I came around by here. He appears to be uh, a little stuck there. He'll catch up eventually. We might want to make rest at base. We might want to make rest at base camp. He's still stuck there. Follow me. I will guide you to the location. No, we're gonna go for a rest and hopefully he'll like come over here. <laughs> well, if you insist. I'm only glad I don't have to lead the way for a change. Cook. Ooh. What? I'm sorry, hang on, that's just an actual video of meat. What? <laughs> Not like a feast to get you ready for What? Bed. I quite agree. At best we recuperate our strength before we set off again. What? Wow, that was uh Our master is a That was just a straight up video of a careful piece of steak. one moment and charging recklessly into battle in the next. I wouldn't have it any other way. Where's your brother gone? Where's the other one? I mean, I get it. Yeah, it's immensely cheaper to just... I guess if we'll... You know what? We'll just head back and... Maybe he'll be there. <laughs> no idea. I don't really understand where the other brother's gone. He's just vanished. The Vanguard is yours. He brought really expensive Feed food on. and cooked it. That's so funny. I really, I love that. I love that that's, they were like, it's cheaper to just buy expensive food and cook it than to try and model really good looking food. I, that's, I think that's absolutely hilarious. What a beautiful workaround. Hey, there he is. Is that him? Thanks, friend. Back at last. That was an ordeal. Hi, I'm exhausted, but I can rest after I've delivered these herbs. I'll be back soon. Good on you. Just take care, all right? Uh, no, it's open world. You can clamber over shit. I think, kind of. You wonder why I don't follow him? So long as he stays away from that forest, he'll be fine on his own. 
Can't clamber up everything. When my brother but... told me he was going to fetch those herbs, I refused to join him. Said it was too dangerous. What would not the like you're not going for like strange. Breath of the Wild, clambering up everything, stamina gauge, but uh, wander around a lot. And I was I right. I I Mayhap none of this would have happened had I only gone with him. My brother is always the one taking the initiative. While I stand around with my hands in my pockets. For them my dick. But today's misadventure showed me that the path forward is the one with fewer regrets. Even when you can't be sure where it leads. We managed to save Norbert. And perhaps that's all that matters. Mayhaps. Still, I can't help but wonder if I couldn't have spared him some of the pain and fear he suffered. If I'd only steeled myself sooner. So from now on, I'm going to trust in my own instincts. Never again will I let fear stop me from doing what I know to be right. With Sir Norbert safely returned, Melv shan't lack for medicinal herbs. Two good deeds in one, you might say. Oh, I'd rec definitely recommend um, the first Dragon's Dogma. It's really fun. Oh yeah, no, definitely. You can definitely explore and shit. Like just you just when you wander out and when you're like wandering out, um, I just kind of randomly find shit as you go. You know, stumble like wander through forests and stumble into shit. This, uh, yeah, you definitely can. You can definitely do some exploring. What does hello again, sir? See. Have you brought some fruit robberant for me? I think I have, yes. Yeah, there you go. Oh, so this is what it looks like. Brilliant. Many thanks, sir. She freaks me out, I don't like her. I haven't much to offer in return, but I'll be sure to tell Grandfather what you did for us. He'll want to reward you proper like, I'll bet. Or oh, proper like. Oh, proper luck. You're going you're gonna to roll me proper luck. Oh, fucking fake. Cheers, mate. One could not have hoped for a gladder outcome. Well, Flora, you better, you better believe I'm going to pay to pay visit your old man, because he better be fucking paying me, because I didn't do that for free. Hey, well met, sir. How? <laughs> fruit. 600 for fruit, Roborant. I think not, sir. I found mine for free. Yeah, I didn't get anything for it, but well, I'm definitely gonna be buying. I'm buying myself a nice pair of new daggers. <laughs> Again, just like too big. My character just too small for everything or something. Everything just looks way too big. <laughs> Why does it look so big? Let's go. Let's go for that. Like. Sort of like 80s, 90s shoulder pa pow power, <laughs> like business power shoulder pads. I shall not be putting a coif upon that man's beautiful hair. Are you kidding me? He's only wearing a helmet if he can, if it can, like, also not be visible on him. <laughs> that looks terrible. Can you make the hats, like, invisible? Because that looks so bad. I'm not putting that on my man. I refuse. I refuse. Look <laughs> how big it is. Uh, right. How's the game? I like it. I like it. I, I, as I expected, I would. It's, it's Dragon's Dogma, you know. Dragon's Dogma 2. Combat's been combat's fun. I like the world. I like that they keep saying Pre drinking sesh you're having, lad. Okay, keep having uh keep having uh saying ought to me and then it confuses me because I think they mean naught, but they do they mean something and it's beautiful. Pre drinks lads is there? Oh lads. Oh, Oh, full of shit. Oh, so none of those I actually need. <laughs> that was... Got cool. I, I got, like... High Salamander. I got a cool bunch of books there. I'll eventually use in a fight. But none of them are the ones she wants. <laughs> I can see myself having, like, a good old time playing this game. 
Well, I mean, you, you try and do oldie worldy talking for like American accent, it just sounds fucking bizarre. <laughs> if you try it, it, any anything other than like British accents in the, with this kind of like talk in this area, and like nah, a couple of European ones as well, like ma mainland European, they just if it, anything else would just sound really really strange. Noon bloom. This ladder looks sturdy enough to climb. After you, Arisen. There's a ladder? Oh, you're talking about that ladder. Ooh, this is pretty. Cinematic sweep. I'm ready. I'm ready to produce a video for E3. Oh, that is a fucking cool move. So this is where you've been. Come with me to the village entrance. The watchhead's waiting for you. Hale, if you've a moment to spare, I'd like a word. Yes? As you can see, we're rebuilding. A task that can always benefit from another pair of hands. What say you? Would you be willing to help? Okay. Excellent. You're a good sort. I'll not soon forget this. Here's what I need from you. A bask of Saurians has made their nest oh, outside the village. Fucking eight of those in the Though original. Yet to cause any harm, their proximity makes the villagers uneasy. Okay. I'd like to enlist your aid in driving them away. I've prepared some explosive casks and left them by the village entrance. Use them to send the Saurians scattering. Okay. A Saurian nest so near the village is worrying indeed. Let us see the explosive casks there as quickly as we may. Tis as you say. I've a selection of wares that sh Fulminous Shield, that's the guy that has Fulminous Shield. Okay, I'm buying it for the quest, but fucking it's very expensive. Fulminous shield, eh? Tis a bargain, I reckon. I picked it up in Melv after the dragon attacked. Can't speak for its contents, but it certainly looks valuable. Go on, have a gander. Go on, have a gander, mate. Come on. Our Where packs are heavier, are? and our purse is far lighter. Go on, mate. Have a These gander. were necessary expenses, mind. No, you have ah, a gander. You've returned. Ooh, wait. <laughs> Good timing, too. I have questions for you. Hang on a minute. I've got a, I've got a man on my shoulder. First and foremost, will you accompany me to the capital? My thanks. Are you ready to depart, or do you need some time to prepare? Uh, give me a bit. Very well. Speak with me once you've finished your preparations. <laughs> have a gander. He's just like, excuse me, sir. Um... Hi, yeah, sorry, I'm, 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 just, I'm, you know, I'm a little busy at the moment. You are in need of healing. Allow me. Wait a moment. What? Ah. <laughs> wow, that was certainly effective. I hope you're ready because you just walked into Dog City. Well, that appears to have sent some of the beasts reeling, at least. I like his hair. To finish the job, I'd have you drop a jar of poison into their nest. Nice, man. You really got a thing against these things. With any luck, the Saurians will realize that they chose a perilous spot and steer clear of the village boundary in future. But pray, take care not to drop it in the river. The villagers use that water on a daily basis. Right, so poison villagers. Got it. You must make sure your aim is true. Are we clear? Good. You'll find the jars of poison just outside the village. Toss one into the Saurian's nest, and your task is done. You couldn't have told me to do this while I was out there already. A single jar of poison, or to send those Saurians packing. Only, uh, uh, do be mindful not to spill any on yourself, Master. <laughs> I'd love the way he said that. Oh, uh, uh, do, do be mindful not to spill on yourself, Master. Please, Master. Uh. Wow. It is about time we were expertly thrown, Master. I'd wager those Saurians will think twice about nesting here again. Thank you, Banj. One could not have hoped for a gladder outcome. You've done as I asked, I see. 
Many thanks for your efforts. And I must say, you've a fine arm. I couldn't have done better myself. Watching you got me thinking. Mayhap you've the sense to inherit the skills I possess. <laughs> or perhaps it's a little early for such talk. No, 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 it's right about time. Right time. In any event, thanks to the work you've done for us today, the rebuilding efforts ought to proceed apace. And for that, I'm grateful. Thank you. A moment long awaited. I that was certainly worthwhile. We have achieved our objective. Yay. Our efforts have been rewarded. Right, um, I want to go over here. Ingredients are plentiful hereabouts. Goblins approach! Holy oh, shit. No means of exploiting our enemy's weakness. Dun 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 dun. Nice takedown, nice takedown. It just died. My Over so soon? Why, we seem to have come through unscathed. We must keep pressing, allow ourselves to become complacent. I keep pressing right bumper Take instead of left bumper to do my test. skills. Oh god. I knew you would prevail, Master. I dare say the Arisen could have defeated this lot without it. Outstanding. Quickly, Arisen, you must regain your footing. Oh, ah, fuck, I'm trying to regain my footing. Ugh, oh, ugh. Oh, so, sta so stamina famished. He sounds like someone trying to do an impression, Michael Kane. Oh, wow, that was very acrobatic of you. That looked great. Well done. How old is Ayn DeVito? Uh, oh, there's a ladder by there. Oh, oh I guess I could have grabbed that. Um, 70, 80s, man? Well done. Now, <laughs> now I can't. I'm still recovering from the last hit. Give me a sec. Tremendous work. Would that we might always be so in step, eh? Hey, hey. After all this time, I finally managed to grab that chest. Is there nothing we can do about this obstacle? I can attack at a moment's notice, Master. I expect you'll be wanting my assistance. Oh, wait, this? Is this an obstacle? There you go. Sorted. There's a magnificent view. The landscape seems to unfold in all directions, revealing its secret to the patient observer. Oh shit, there's a chest by there. Hello. Ooh, there's all sorts of little secrets around here. Oh. A well organized pack is my specialty. I'll see to it your burdens are shared between us pawns. Hayabusa. Oh shit, it's Ryu Hayabusa from fucking <laughs> Hayabusa's fucking uh, Ninja Gaiden. Ryu Hayabusa, Ninja Gaiden character. Hayabooty Busa. Level 12, goddamn. Ooh. 
I might take you with me for a bit. This is a, this is a rare chance to hire a higher level pawn for uh, freebies. Hiya, booty boo, sir. Ooh, let's hire you. Um, I guess the swap out Casablanca, I guess. Um, you can have the gift of a fruit robot. Robot. If ever you've need of an ear to listen, you have but to ask. Special use skills that can only be acquired by pawns. They are not strictly beneficial, but for they allow the pawn to act independently, and this can result in unexpected consequences. However, with a little patience, planning, and due care, specializations can prove very useful and are well worth trying out. If you would like your pawn to learn a specialization, you would do well to befriend people with various traits and tendencies in the world around you. Sooner or later, these friendships are bound to create opportunities for your pawn to acquire a specialization. Pawn can only acquire one specialization at a time, and learning a new specialization will replace the old one. Consult each specialization century for more. Oh, sounds very interesting. What's, uh, what's your thing, then? Pawns award badges as a mark of their accumulated knowledge and expertise, whether that be proficiency in combat or experience exploring. Pawns of badges are more helpful to the origin in world, in word and in deed. Monsters' badges are awarded to pawns who have defeated a certain number of particular type of monster. Such pawns are by then, uh, by then so experienced with the creature in question that they know the best way to defeat it and will offer beneficial advice to the arisen. Field badges are awarded to pawns who have camped a sufficient number of times in a particular region. When adventuring in said region, the pawn will display their knowledge of the area by offering beneficial advice to the arisen. Cool. Ah, oh, so they're a logistician. Logistician. Logistician? Logistician. I guess that's right. The pawn who acquires this skill gains the initiative to combine materials and move items between allies' packs. <laughs> so you're just going to be shuffling. You're going to be shuffling shit all over the place. All right. Seems a little intrusive. All right, Hayabusa. Sir Gregor wishes to speak with you, Master. Shall we go to him? Allow me to guide you, Master. I know the person you're looking for. I don't the care. The vanguard is yours. Lead on. I don't care where I've you... i just recalled. I found a treasure chest near here during my travels beyond the rift. May I show you to its location? Oh, uh, yeah. Sir Gregor wishes to speak with you, Master. Shall we go to him? No, 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 show me the fucking... I believe I can guide you to the person in question. No, 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 well, no. Well, if you insist, I'm only glad I don't have to lead the way for a change. You can show me where the treasure chest is. I don't, I don't fucking... I don't want you to me to Greg it, though. Okay, well, I know there's a couple treasure chests around here, so we'll grab all of them. Right, so there's one. <gasps> These really are Seeker hidden token. in the most unlikely places, aren't they? Our collection grows. Interesting. I shall have to inform my own master of this. Damn, Glory's gonna come back with some real information. Ooh, Ring of Cooling. <laughs> Glory, <laughs> the, the owner of Glory gets their pawn back. They'd be like, oh, uh, there's something there, 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 and uh, there. I'm guessing this is the little cave we saw. No. Oh shit, I missed. Step master, only We have no means of exploiting our enemy weakness. Element resist weaknesses and resistance. You can deal damage to your foes more effectively by exploiting their elemental weakness and reduce the amount of damage taken from elemental attacks by donning equipment that increases your elemental resistance. If you have a point in your party with sufficient knowledge, they will be able to inform you of your foes' resistances and weaknesses when you face them on the field of battle. Making use of skills and equipment that enable you to inflict elemental damage can grant you a significant advantage over your foes. For instance, combining attacks that inflict debilitations of attacks that deal elemental damage will allow you to plague your enemies with some truly devastating debilitations. Cool. <laughs> Pawn badges. What'd you get them for? DP, you know, shit like that. Okay, okay, okay. The 
That was superb. Oh yeah, let's go. I love when they high five me. Oh, hmm. well spotted. Good money. I'm sure my master would be astonished to learn this is here. Your master needs to be a bit more aware. They've not lived for they're not finding much, are they? Alright, that was good. That was a good haul, man. We found a bunch of treasure chests around here. I'm happy we came here. I am curious what's going on over there. A fine place to harvest <laughs> some ingredients. <laughs> the way he it's falls is so good. Use them when the need arises. I love it. It just looks like he looks like he's gonna just fall on his face. I hope my pawn never talks about me like that. Oh, you better believe it. Ooh. Logisticians, uh... <laughs> Man, when you run out of breath like this, you, you guy sounds really... Let me get that. Chess sounds terrible. <laughs> like, Jesus, you're right. <laughs> Sounds like me when I try and run two seconds. <laughs> I'm not built for cardio, I'm built for short bursts of power. Oh, oh boy, it's again. Getting dark. <laughs> I'm thinking of that episode of uh, Brooklyn Nine Nine where Terry's like, oh, I, "I can run a bit. I haven't done cardio in like two, five years, but it shouldn't be it shouldn't be too bad." <laughs> he starts like, "This is instantly awful." I'm sure we'll find a purpose for it in due time. Dan, our boy's making all sorts of salubrious drafts. Traveling at night in this game is an absolute disaster. Time is an ever-flowing river in this world, and the activities and behaviors of its inhabitants reflect this. People are unlikely to remain in the same place all day long, all day long, and may only appear in the morning, at night, or at midday. To pass the time, you can either stay at an inn or make use of one of the special seats found outdoors in set, lo set locations. Come nightfall, you will be able to see no further than the ground at your feet. And the onset of darkness summons fearsome monsters not seen by day. Explore the wilderness after sunset at your own peril. Be sure to have a lantern in your pack. Uh, some items that can be gathered will change over time, such as by ripening and growing more flavorful. There are also items that, if allowed to age just long enough, will become more useful when combining materials. Ooh. However, you should keep a close eye on raw items in particular, as consuming anything that has been aged past its prime is likely to have unpleasant side effects. Certain objects and structures that can be destroyed by your attacks will regenerate after a set amount of time has passed. Similarly, fruits, berries, and other gatherable flora will grow back after a time. That's cool. Make haste, then. We must leave anon. No. Very well. Speak with... We're not leaving at night. Are you crazy, man? <laughs> Just, uh... <laughs> Just lying on the wood boards. That makes you look like a vampire. <laughs> I wish they're sleeping. They're fucking prop like vampires. There's a ladder here. Perhaps new discoveries await us above. Above. Perhaps new discoveries await us above. I'm enjoying this game. This is really fun. Um. This is really fun. I mean, I expected myself to enjoy this game, to be honest, but... This boy looks good with these tattoos. I'm thinking I should get these exact same tattoos. <laughs> Plank-only bed. It's the kind of bed I, uh, I really think we should all strive for. I'm sure there's something out there that says plank-only beds are actually, like, the optimal way to sleep. <laughs> yeah, cling on beds. <laughs> Ever, that, that, that always reminds me of that scene in... That's, like, one of my favorite scenes when, uh, he's like, Oh, yes! Good for the back. And then he's like trying to sleep and then Data's just staring at him and he's like, what are you doing? He's like, oh, I'm just, you know, taking in, taking in my, 
<laughs> information for the day. And he's like, okay. And he's just lying in there and Data's in the back. Just, I, I had some really, just like really good acting and comedy in that bit. I love it. He's just like, you know what? I don't need to sleep. I don't need to sleep. <laughs> Considering, like, how serious Patrick Stewart is throughout most of that show, like, that shows that he's, like, you're, like, oh, no, he, he does know. He has got good comedy timing. He's Because he plays it, like, you know, he's mostly plays Picard very, very straight. All right, Mendez, sorry. Too busy too busy being a, being an absolute chatty. Bruh. Fucking Star Trek. I'm too busy throwing footballs at nerds. Star Trek is, uh, well, Next Generation specifically is my absolute fucking comfort. Fucking nerd. <laughs> hey, dude, you get a load of the nerd over there? Excuse me? What did you say? Alright, ads are over. Welcome back, everybody. Shibbity boo boo. What's everyone gathered over here for? Forgive me, but I cannot guide you from here. I'm trying to work out where that kid went with the grandfather. Where are, we going? are you trying to lead me back on the mission? No. I'm trying to find that girl grandpa. I promised I was promised a reward. <laughs> Sleep on a fucking mattress, you weirdos. Yeah, I don't know where that girl lives. <laughs> I think she doesn't. I'm starting to think she doesn't even live here. I don't know. Well, I, well, just when I gave her the thing, she was like, "Oh, I'm sure my grandfather would be would be happy to give you some, give you, give you a reward." And I was just like, "Yeah, but where does he live?" <laughs> this ladder is here for a reason. Like, After uh, you, arisen. It probably is. She probably was just saying that. But like, still, I uh, I'm just very curious uh, where. All right, lady, let's go. <laughs> oh, Shay, you okay? Oh, no, she's okay. All right. <laughs> Better go. Better go. There's a lot of blood then. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I'm sorry. I just wanted to. As far as this. Where's the talk? I'm so sorry. Over here, if you please. Here at the inn, we also I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles myself. Some rest, shall shall we get some rest then? <laughs> well, you know, they wouldn't say no because of the implication. Dennis, you keep saying that word. Are you, do you want these women to be scared? No, 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 no. They're not going to be scared. You know, everyone, they, no, no one's going to no one's forced and everything. No one's got a choice. You know, but they wouldn't say no because of the implication. <laughs> hey, you, you keep saying that. They probably should end Sunny soon. They've. I feel like they've kind of. I feel like they've kind of lost the spark of Sunny these days. I might have to jump off. Uh, I got to go to my friend's gig at half seven, and it's. Coming up to quarter past six now, I need to have a shower.